What is happening, heroes? Three in here of time here, presenting you with some vanilla double scoop. I'm here with Matt, and uh, here's the deal. So we actually recorded this part already, and then we recorded a second part for this episode. And somehow, when I recorded the second part of this episode, something happened to the first part, and it's gone. And so I'm going to show you everything we've done. And so you guys see the chicken cooker already. Um, I used the first half of the episode to actually build this chicken cooker, but luckily. For us, it's a really simple one. Um, I thought about tearing it down and rebuilding it, but nah. <laughs> and uh, it's really simple, so I'm just going to walk you through it and show you how I did it. And if you know anything about redstone or redstone farms, you probably know how to make this one already. And if you're confused, just say so in the comments, and I'll post a video about how to make it if you want me to. Um, but there's plenty of videos online about how to make chicken cookers like this. When we make our actual house, we'll make one way cooler anyway. So... Um, what it's going to start off with is this chest right here, and then there's a hopper feeding into the chest. There's a half slab on top of the hopper, okay? And then behind the hopper, you have a block. Then you have two dispensers, uh, facing one facing the slab and then one on top of that dispenser, all right? So we'll keep heading back. There's a hopper pointing into the bottom dispenser, okay? And then there's a comparator leading from the hopper, so pointing that way leading from the hopper into a block, okay, and the block it's heading into is this one, all right, there's a redstone torch on that side, okay, which points up into this block, then there's another block here with the redstone dust on it, then there's a redstone torch right here facing the hopper, and there's the cobblestone up here with nothing on it, uh, and then there's another cobblestone here with the redstone dust on it, okay, so, one more time, uh, real fast, hoppers, two dispensers, hopper, um, comparator, go around to this block with a redstone block, block with redstone dust, and a torch block, block with redstone dust. And so what happens is, I'm trying not to look away because we've done a lot since, since uh, you'll be seeing this. Just looking down. Yeah, I'm just looking down. Uh, so what happens is you go up here, and basically I tried to lead chickens in from our farm, and it didn't go well. Um, but I just got a bunch of eggs, and we've just been egging in here, and there's there's probably like 50 chickens in here at this point. So what happens is uh, the eggs get laid. They go in the hopper. The hopper puts them into this dispenser. The dispenser shoots them into here where there is baby chickens. And then this thing has lava, and every time a le egg shoots out, lava disperses. And then it, you can see it goes back right after it comes out. And so what will happen is in uh, a few minutes, all these chickens will be adults. So next time it shoots out an egg, well, not all these, but, you know, the, you get it. Uh, in a couple of minutes, some of them will be adults. So the next time an egg gets shot out, lava will come out and burn a chicken. Okay? And so then the chicken meat will fall on top of the slab, and it will get sucked up into the hopper, and into the chest it will go. Uh in the second half of this video, you'll see uh, some of the results of it and the turnout of it um, and how, how how well it works and stuff like that. We did have one other thing that we showed in the video, but I don't think... Okay, I'll, I'll show it. So here's this charcoal cooker. I, I actually took some parts off of it for something else now, but the way it worked was... Uh, all you had to do was put in one piece of charcoal and then a piece of wood, and then you could put all the wood into this chest. And then what would happen is the wood would feed down into the furnace, and it would forever supply itself. And basically what would happen is eventually the furnace would get full of charcoal. And so, okay, so this would uh, make charcoal, which would go into this hopper, and then the hopper would send it into the dispenser, dispenser would send it back into the hopper. So it's really simple. It's like chest to hopper, to furnace, to hopper, to dispenser, to hopper, back to furnace, to fuel. Okay, and but at some point, this furnace would be full, and this hopper would be full, and there was another hopper here that led to this chest, and when the dispenser would shoot up, and if this was full, the charcoal wouldn't get caught in it, and it would get caught in this one, and it would go in this chest. And we actually made a couple stacks, but I haven't really been, been focusing on it. Um, so that's all that stuff. Um, if you want to know more about the chicken cooker, let me know. Uh, some notes I have to observe. Uh, I think I say this later on in the video, but uh, don't build it out of glass like I did. Just because they do occasionally glitch through here, and sometimes one will get free. And uh, so mobs and gla glass are really 
glitchy and ignore her um anyway uh so uh that's basically it uh okay oh, see now we can see uh, how it works there's this chicken's burning and boom you have meat so that's it and the the reason why we're making a charcoal cooker is because we're using coal in our build which is going to be humongous our plan that we can't say yet yeah <laughs> okay so uh there's going to be some stuff that you just saw maybe glances of that won't be in the second half of this episode that's because all the stuff that lots of the stuff I've done I've done after this episode is recorded um so I just had to record this first half so if you recognize any of or if you see any of these things and you're wondering where they'll be at in the second half it's cuz they're not actually there yet but in the third episode they'll be there so uh, we've done a lot uh, since then, and the third episode will be crazy. And uh, all right, so uh, that's basically it. And I will see you guys on the review of how this works and the rest of the episode. All right, see you guys in a bit. All right, guys, we're back. Um, so we took a we stopped after whatever we did last time. I don't remember what it was, but uh, we decided to take a break to let the chicken cooker work and let you see how it did. Um, basically, we got off last night and I AFK'd. And I guess I was AFK for about five, maybe six hours total. Uh, so not a whole long time. Um, but here's the chicken and feathers we have so far. Uh, we have about five and a half stacks of chicken. Uh, about six whole stacks of feathers. It's pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and take this out. Yeah, so go ahead and put that inside. And some things I noticed about it, I'd like to point out to you guys. Uh, the chickens in there, they look like they're coming out, and it made me nervous, and I know why it is, but it's it's still nerve-wracking. And the reason that they look like they're coming out is because I use glass. So if you're going to make this, it's better not to use glass, because mobs do glitch with, with glass, and sometimes they do glitch right on out. And uh, you're seeing now how this works, because eggs are being laid. So these big chickens are laying eggs. It's being shot out. These chickens hatch and when they grow up the next time an egg's thrown out the lava will come out and burn up the chicken and you'll have burnt you'll have cooked chicken and feathers now the next one we'll be making next time when we have our actual home we'll have multiple settings and one of them will be to let you breed chickens you can set it to where it just breeds chickens you can set it to where it gives you raw chicken and you can set it to where it gives you cooked chicken so there you go the raw chicken by drowning, cooked chicken by lava, and the other chicken by... Let me get... I should get chicken, because I don't have very much of this beef. And we have a, a ton of chicken. So, we did that. We might as well go, because... Yeah. We don't need to. Alright, we did that. Um, we're just going to go find the snow biome. It's in my chat. Yeah, okay. Um, we're going to go find the snow biome. Um, we've done two inventions on this episode. That's... Like, way more than... Holy cow. That's... Oh, my gosh! What? Dude, I just went flying off that thing. Oh, come on. What? I just got, like, blown off the nether portal somehow. There's, like, a creeper in there. Dude. I haven't spawned yet. Oh, jeez. There was a bunch of mobs in there and stuff, and they just destroyed me. Gosh. Gosh. Oh, jeez, Lou. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I'm going to try to get down there, and hopefully... Okay, we're getting slaughtered, because I don't know why. I have another server with out. the same exact provider and everything, and I don't have any problems with it. Same size, and it's modded. It's got a mod pack with, like, 30 mods on it. No, 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 like, 45 oh, mods Oh, I on died. It. Yeah, see, I did, too. Uh, the skeleton or a creeper like blew me off the top or something. Maybe, oh, it might have been gas. I think I have all my stuff still. Oh, I have everything but the netherrack. I don't care about that too much. Okay, so we've done quite a bit. Uh, we're just going to head on our way in the nether. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed us dying. That was exciting. I am lagging so bad. Uh, we're we're going we're gonna to fight through this lag, and we'll see you guys a little bit later. Uh, uh, we're having a hard time loading in right now, so I think we'll just... We'll let it load in, and we'll we'll see you guys back in a second. <laughs> Man, no. thought I'd give you a boost. Oh, this isn't. No, this isn't particularly safe, but you know. 
Okay, you go ahead. I I can't hear gas, so... Okay, I, I get it. I should have brought a bow, probably. I should have gave you my armor. Yeah. Probably would be a bummer to Can die. you tell me if you see one, though? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm watching while I build the rails. I hear one. But I don't see it. Oh. One just really? spawned way over there. He didn't see us, though. Here, I'm going to try to be closer to him. Okay, he's aggroing me right now. He's literally shooting at me. Don't mess up my bridge. You try to kill him real quick. I hear another one too. I'm kinda of scared to get too far from him. Oh, oh he's right here. No, I'm fine. Don't worry. Don't even worry about it. That's the one I'm after. Well, I'm oh, come it. on! Jeez. It's too hard to fight the things. Yo, Stay don't still. walk across me. Oh yeah, this is a bad place to be if he blows it up. Yeah, this is pretty good video though. Jeez, come here. Dude, this looks so cool from it, my point yeah. Oh my god. They definitely improved the gas responses because before, like, I would not be rebounding these so well. I think they worked on that because, you know, it used to be that half the time when you hit them, they just hit you. But now they actually uh, But maybe that was because my food was Oh my gosh, I see this stage. Come on. Did you do that? Kinda widened it a little bit. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about the rails. If you don't just go sprinting across this thing, that's kinda your problem. Alright, I should make it uh alright. That's good. Good enough. Good enough. Okay, we're heading the right way. Are we? Okay, I think we need to head up from here. Onto this. Onto this. Okay. Let's go that other way. Your turn. Alrighty. <laughs> hey! hey, hey. Look, I have the magic touch. <laughs> That's awesome. Alright, alrighty. Oh, guest. Watch out. Holy cow, he hit me. Why would he hit me? That was scary. Jeez, I had my back turned to him. Alright, there you go. Let's go, bro. He didn't want to fight you. You must look too tough. Oh, come on! He dodges them or something now, man. They made them more respons- the fireballs more responsive, but they made him dodge them as well. Oh, how did that not hit him? That hit him right on. Yep. What? He, like, actively dodges them now. Oh, that won't work. Okay, we got aim better here. Never mind. Yeah, what happened? He's gone. He despawned. Because gas, when they fight you, they're. Lots of times they're at the despawn distance from you. Alright, we made it to approximately where we want to be. Maybe. Um, hopefully, this is not wide enough, you know. Oh, I guess we could put it in the ground. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Uh, we made it basically to where we want to be. Oh, now it's ugly. I'm sorry. You can dig it out to a pretty fire. I don't want to lose any, so I just... This was a good idea, kind of, I thought. Alright. Oh, um, wait, no, I don't need to dig it out. I just need to. Hopefully this will be... We're wanting it to be an ice plane spike. Uh, I looked it up in a midst, and uh, this should be it. But we'll we'll find out. Are you coming? No. I'm... A few things happened. Not a whole lot happened while we were there. Or while we were running through, but uh, we got attacked by some. I killed a wither skeleton. He didn't drop anything. Uh, we fought a gas. Both of them despawned before we could kill him. The gas fireballs are, are way more responsive now than they used to be, but the gas like actively dodged them. So 
I don't know. What, I don't know how I feel about it. So it is so dark in here. Does your texture pack make everything darker? I see this. No. I'm coming in right now. All right. I'm probably gonna lag really hard, but dude, like it is like so, like super dark when I'm in here. I don't know if you guys can see it all, but I'm just grabbing this coal real quick. Yeah, I'm lagging. Matt's lagging because that's what his game does. It's a great game. Yeah. Let's grab these mushrooms. I love it. Do you have ghosts on you still? Hey, look. Hey. Ice spike. Is that ice? Yep. Oh, yeah. Alright, I got what we came here for. Let's leave. All for the snow. It was literally for like a few blocks of snow. Alright, let's see. Um, How much chicken do you have? Do you have a lot still? 15. Okay, I was going to say, because I'm about... So I was trying to figure out if uh, I'm going to have to look for some, like, some wood. So I can... Wow, are we really doing this? Alright, for now. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Let's just get a bunch of snow, and then uh, wow. we'll come back here when we have silk touch pickaxes. That's one other thing we need to do before we end this episode, is we need to make an enchantment table. So I can start enchanting stuff. Because I keep losing levels and I'm, I've had about enough. We could also go kill those blazes with this. We found like three nether fortresses walking, so... Uh, yeah, there is a lot of nether fortresses around. And even right by our I mean, I didn't notice until like we were about to leave that there's another fortress literally right next to our house. And, I don't uh, know how you didn't notice that. Uh, and I already saw blaze spawner really close to our house that we can go back and use. If we want to make a blaze, I don't know if I want to make a blaze for I want to make the, the uh, zombie pigmen farm, so. Yeah. So I don't know if we'll even waste our time with a blaze farm, because it won't be, we'll never use it when we have the zombie pigmen farm. Uh, all right. All right, Are we good? Yeah. We're yeah. Good. This is good. We'll come back here when we have silk touch. But for now, the snowballs are all we need. Um, so we'll, I want to make a wither farm, but I think a wither farm will be a few days worth of a project. That'll probably be a project for summer, <laughs> when when I have when we have time to just sit here and destroy a whole fortress. Then we'll do it. Um, uh, can I have some chicken? Please. Oh, Second, yeah. I'm doing a laggy thing again. You pretty fight it. Um. Anyway, so uh, we'll make a wither farm. Uh, so we won't get the wither until we're ready to make a wither farm. We're not just going to not mess with them. I've never made the wither farm, but I've seen some pretty cool designs for some pretty cool uh, crazy ones. I'm all for making them, and we'll make the zombie pigment farm after that as well. So that's what we're going to do. Um, we're going to journey back through the nether, and uh, I don't know. I guess we got to make an enchantment table and do some enchants, even though we have low levels right now. I think it's over here. Oh, we need these. We need these. Oh, yeah, we do. We do. We need a uh, plant of pumpkin food. These are for our snowman. snowman. Oh, I'm glad we came up. Snowman pumpkins. We got snowman pumpkins. We can make snowman people, guys. Okay. okay. Let's see. Where is the zombie spawner? The zombies aren't... Okay, where did we spawn? Right here. I hear zombies. Come back here. I hear zombies where I'm at right now. There's a zombie spawner here if I can hear a zombie at this point in the day. Where? Oh, yeah, dude, there's one right down here. It's literally under the mountain. <laughs> like, I just walked right up to it. Where? This is almost like a surface spawner. Hang on. Uh, where? Hang on, I'm coming up. I'll come straight. Look, you see me. Look down. Look straight down. You just... You see me? You, you just mine? No, no, no. Uh, there's a cave over here. It was literally under... That's why we were hearing zombies and zombies were attacking us the whole time. Because they were literally right beneath us. Here is the zombie spawn, guys. If you remember on the first episode, in the first, like, five minutes, zombies were all over the place. Oh, I, think. I don't know if zombies were actually all over the place when we were playing, but... Like, right before we were playing, we were getting killed by zombies yeah. waiting to record. Like, we both died, like, twice because we were... I was, like, going away from the screen to set up recording stuff, and I kept dying. And I was like, oh, my gosh, we just started. And the zombies are just killing us. 
They were just spawning above. So, uh, hmm, we could use this to get some levels real quick, but boy, if it'd be slow. So we found a zombie spawn, but I don't know what we're going to do with it. We probably won't do much with it, to be honest. Because we don't need, I don't want to make an XP farm out of a, a spawner. You know? Not one. Uh -oh. All right, we're just going to try and get some levels with these zombies here, and we will try to make an enchantment today. We did set up the enchantment table. We didn't show you it, but we'll show you it in a second. And maybe, we'll see, we'll, we'll get 30 levels, we'll make an enchantment before this episode ends, whether it's 30 levels or not. We're okay. making a pumpkin farm, guys. And, oh, there's the enchantment table. Pretty nice. Uh, we Wait, had, was we I, killed a bunch of Was I of supposed to put it there? What do you mean? Is this where you want the water? Yeah, never mind. But yeah, that's where I dug the hole. Uh, we we found some pumpkins. Oh, you guys saw that. Anyway, um, we uh made this enchantment table. Uh, we killed a bunch of cows, but then uh they had resexed and grown into adult cows. Um, now we're playing a bunch of pumpkins. Uh, I will build an automatic pumpkin farm, but as we said before, we're waiting until our home in order to uh start doing that stuff because we don't want to just uh. Can you fill that in? Cause I messed it up. Indeed. Uh, we're waiting until our actual home to do stuff like that. We don't want to waste time doing things like that. We made the chicken farm here just because we want an easy supply of food. I was trying to convince Matt to let us make the iron farm before we make the home, but he said that's stupid. So, Sorry. next episode, uh, we will we'll make a cobblestone generator and snow generator off camera because everybody knows how to do that. Um, and uh, I guess we'll get glowstone because that's part of our build. We'll get coal. We're going to do a lot of mining uh, in between this and the next episode. And, uh, yeah, we're going to start the build. We'll at least start planning. There's going to be a lot of uh, planning out for the next build, and we'll start the first layer. It all makes sense when we do it. It's kind of hard to describe. Our build's going to be big, and it's going to be scary. It's going to make you pee yourself. It'll be awesome. Hope you guys are enjoying. Um, comment if you... Uh, have any advice for any of our devices we've got here? If you have anything, any ideas for stuff we can add to our build, it will be massive. It will have several compartments. If you have ideas for compartments or something, that'd be cool. Maybe by the time this is uploaded, we won't be that far, but we might be. Yeah. You got anything to add, Matt? Um, have a good day or night, if it's day or night. Yeah. And you're watching this. Have a good one, guys. Seize your destiny. Strike subscribe to become a hero today. Mm. See ya. Beautiful.